Hello Cancer and <laughs> I have tried to do your intro like 12 times I promise you and each time I couldn't like get myself together because this is so freaking funny like y'all don't even understand so hello Cancer and welcome back to my channel so before we get into your reading these messages are general um if you would like to get a personal reading all of that information is in the description box down below Sorry, I had to like take a little break because I literally could not stop laughing. And you know what the funny thing about it is? I feel like my guides were like pushing me to laugh even more because your this hater is hating, all right? Like it's just like why is your face like that? Like why why is your like I feel like somebody has a screwed face. I feel like somebody is super like just just like like a like a rat like 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 you know how rats just move back and forth back and forth back and forth back and forth this person can have rats i don't know but like this person they're just like all over the place like they go from like one thing to the next okay so i feel like somebody's stalking you i feel like somebody goes from like one page of yours to like the next one or like one social media platform to the next one to the next one to see like what you're doing it's so weird now when i was first tapping into your energy i did feel a lot of fire energy so you could have like a prominent um fire placement or you could even be a fire sign with like a cancer moon or you could be a leo with the cancer moon or uh, Aries with the Cancer Moon, because I was feeling a lot of fire when I was tapping into your energy. But your, when I tell you, this person is so damn jealous. I feel like this person that you're dealing with, Cancer, is way more jealous than all of the signs that I did, and that says a lot because there was a lot of jealousy in all of those readings. But like this one tops all of them. Like this person. Ugh, it's weird because they want to be you and they want to be like you but they they don't like you what is this i just feel like you guys are in like a really good place or you're about to be you guys have like your own business or you just like study a business or you started like putting efforts into your business and i feel like your ships are coming in i feel like you're you're getting money or you will be getting a lot of money um and there's someone that kind of like is popping back up because they want to see like what you're doing and what you got going on for some of you this could be this is definitely like an ex-friend because like you got snake in the camp major jealousy and the rumors are freaking facts i feel like you cut someone off or like just do them out and like they can't they can't like run away from you or they can't they can't get out of your energy because they're just so obsessively jealous with you. It's weird. Some of you, this could be like um, an ex-friend. But for others of you, I feel like you don't even view this person as a friend. Like, I feel like they were just like a person to you. And like, yeah, I'm getting this energy of just like throwing away like a person literally or like a situation. You could have just grew apart. But it feels more so like you threw this person out or like you threw a situation out. And it's like they can't get out of your energy because they want your position so this could definitely be in the workplace but it doesn't feel like that because i feel like this person doesn't even have direction um i also feel like you're dealing with a male that's coming back around like i feel like this person could never leave you you look the moon so you could have a cancer freaking moon if you have a cancer moon or even if you're like a cancer um like a cancer sun woman or a cancer venus is what i just heard as well um I feel like this is for you because this feels very masculine like a man can't leave a situation yeah and the eight of cups in reverse to me is like throwing something out so I feel like you do this person out but they keep on coming back yeah it's like you found out that somebody was a snake you found out somebody was a hater and you threw their ass out and they all up in your energy because they want what you have and for some of them they feel like sometimes they can take what you have or like sometimes they they i don't know oh that's so weird you know what i'm getting with this will of fortune for some of them they secretly want like karma <laughs> what this person like wants karma because you threw them out but like that's not happening i feel like you still on the will of fortune it's like this person wants you to be like broke or broken but like you still winning i feel like you even winning more because you cut this motherfucker out who the hell is this 
All right, Cancer, so let's get into your reading. Okay, Cancer, let's see what's coming towards you. Y'all know it be super cold in my studio, so I had to bring out the big sweater. Yeah, look. Some <laughs> Cancer, look. Somebody is so j jealous. Just jealous. Like, so jealous. Oh, you know what I'm hearing? So, me and my sister, we used to come up with, like, <laughs> we used to come up with, like, scenes and stuff. Um, because my sister, she's a baddie. And I'm a baddie, too. I have a Taurus rising. And my sister, she's a Libra sun with a Taurus moon. So, like, that's double Venusian. So, like, people in that town would, like, be super jealous. Like, they would just always be up in our face. And we used to say, like, damn, she's in it to win it. Like, you all up in it. Like, I feel like <laughs> I feel like somebody is all up in your stuff. Like, somebody is all up in your business. They're watching you. They want to know what you're doing. It's weird. Okay, two cards for what's coming towards cancer. Yeah, anxiety and action. Look, all of the energy is cornucopia. I don't even feel like this is you. I feel like somebody somebody panics when you take action on things. Or like somebody panics when you make moves. Yeah, because I was getting the energy like you're very stable, Cancer. Or like you're very just happy. Like you could be a high priestess as well. Because that's really sticking out to me. But yeah, I feel like you're very happy. And it's like there's somebody else that's like crying and panicking and like going through a tower moment every single time you make a move. And that's just the facts. Weird. All right. Honestly, Cancer, I'm not surprised by this energy. Yeah, but like people, other people think that you are. <laughs> okay. So let's say, let's say, um, what's I about to say? Yeah, somebody's so, y'all, this energy is ridiculous. Sometimes I wish I could like show you guys the energy or make you feel the energy, you know what I'm saying? But it's like somebody feels like you don't know that they're a snake or like you don't know that they watch you, but you do know. Like you do know. For some of you, this person recently like tried to pop up or they will try to, which is very weird. Yeah, but I'm I'm not surprised that I'm getting all of this energy because of, like, you know, the energy that, like, I felt when you guys were, when I was tapping into your energy. Like, as soon as I tapped into your energy, I felt the Queen of Wands energy immediately. I was like, oh, okay, fire. It, you know what? It, it felt like I was doing a freaking fire sign reading. That's how much, like, confidence or just passion or, like, um... Yeah, just confidence you guys have right now. What's coming towards cancer? Yes, yeah, someone is getting tarot readings on you. I feel like the person that's watching you inquires about you. So, like, this person could be a tarot reader, but, like, they... <laughs> what the hell? What does this person want? Cancer. It's like this person gets tarot readings on you. What kind of tarot readings does this person get? Like, what do they ask? That's so interesting. What does this person ask? Five of Wands? You got an argument with this person or something? Or it could just be like petty things. Six of Cups. Some of them get tarot readings on, like, your past. That's weird. Yeah. For some of you, you have to be dealing with... <gasps> oh. You know what I'm getting, y'all? This is so weird. Somebody gets tarot readings on, <laughs> on you to, like, know every little detail about your life. Like, not only, like, the dudes that you, that you pull, but also, like, what you, what you did in your past, um, how your money is going to be coming towards you. That's so weird. It's like this person wants to know every single detail of your life. 
because you probably could have ghosted them or you probably could have just ended them yeah look it could have been a friend yeah because somebody was acting like a dm fool or somebody is a dm fool yeah look that's just the truth <laughs> <laughs> and again, I was getting that energy of like they want karma on you, but but they can't get it. It's like they're in the five of swords. Like I I I can't stand you. Like I, I'm I'm gonna beat you. I'm gonna beat you. Or I'm gonna win. And like you just working, like not giving a damn or something. What the heck is this? Yeah, can't take all the heat. Worst time in ever. Pills. Big push. Ooh, you know what I'm getting? And this is going to sound really crazy. Yeah, look, tension is building. This is going to sound really crazy, y'all. A bum views you, like, not stepping off of your throne and, like, down to their level as like you being pussy like okay so how can i explain this right now you're in like the, the queen of wands queen of um cups energy like you're very like like royal or like regal um it feels like you're, you're on your freaking throne and it's like like how can i explain this energy it kind of feels like peasant energy it's like a peasant wanted you like do something at you and wanted you to respond or like a peasant wanted you to like stoop down to their level in some type of way and because you just like didn't even like you just erased it or like you just like <laughs> pushed it away or threw it out it's like they're viewing you as being kind of put like pussy or like scared but like that's not the facts this person is a weirdo i don't even you i promise you this this is a, this this is weird yeah they're mixy and you could be like um starting a new endeavor. It's like this person this person wants to know like what's coming towards you before they want to know like what's coming towards them. That's weird. IG model, incoming scandal, snobby as fuck behind the scenes, dark arts, A list status, yeah, and D list status. I feel like somebody is mad about either your position or or just where you are in life. Weird. And they could be like spreading lies and rumors about you as well. To like other people that don't fuck with you. But I feel like the people that they spread lies to. Don't even fuck with them. That's ugh, whatever. Alright Cancer. What's coming towards? Yeah. <laughs> Look. Big mad. Why are you so mad? <laughs> <laughs> I feel like somebody needs to eat some damn ice, alright? Okay, let's see, Cancer. What's coming towards my Cancers? Child. Yeah, shady. Again, Cancer, I'm getting a lot of fire. Like, boss, bad bitch energy. You know what I'm saying? Now, when I say fire energy, even if you're not a fire sign, you're harnessing fire energy. Because it's like... You're not on guard, but you're just like, I don't know, something about your energy. It just feels very strong and like stoic and like, I wish a motherfucker would. Or like, I wish, <laughs> I wish, I wish a bitch would gossip. Yeah, somebody's gossiping about like your past. That doesn't even freaking matter. Past life. So your past life could be very important. Ooh, or some of you soon are going to get like a reading on your past life. That's interesting. I love doing past life readings. Okay, let's see. Two more for cancer. I'll take the... Ooh, look. Okay, you know what? I was picking up on this energy when I did the collective reading. And it was like there was somebody that has an STD or like somebody that was very promiscuous that was hating on someone. I feel like it's the same energy. So if you resonated with that reading, that might be for you. Gossip. Your ex is coming back with some communication. I feel like you don't want to talk to this motherfucker. Weird. 
A tower moment is on the horizon, healing and praying. Well, since it came out, I am going to clarify it. But again, Cancer, you got like somebody just doing the freaking most because they, it kind of feels like somebody that got kicked out of something. So if this is like a love interest, they're very big mad that you're like not fucking with them. If this is like an ex-friend, they're very mad. They're like, they're not in your circle no more. Ooh, this type of moment could be like magic. Okay, let's see. What's this tower moment for cancer? King of Cups. Yeah, look. Devil wanted to peek out. Nine of Swords. Damn, Five of Pentacles. Five of Wands. Eight of Cups. Empress, yeah, you're in your Empress energy. Look, three of damn, three of swords with the three of pentacles. This is weird because I feel like I feel like this is all of the energy that this other person has going on around them. Why do I feel that way? Cancer, you could be dealing with, like, a very low vibrational male, is what I'm seeing. Like, this the, this person can never get these shit together. Um, but what I'm, what I'm also seeing is, like, there could have been a male. Okay, you could be, like, a cross watcher. So, there could have been a cancer male that, like, you did not work with or that you did not. What is this? Like, yeah, I just saw 555. Five, five, so this is a real, real tower moment. It's like there's somebody that you didn't come together with or that you didn't accept. Like, I feel like you left this person out in the cold due to an argument of some sort. And they're, like, really stressing out about it. I feel like somebody is, like, crying. I also feel like this could be, like, a hater energy. Because, again, with this yellow sticking out, I feel like this is you. I was feeling it in your love energy. You could not even know who this person is. Or, like, this person doesn't even really know who you are. And what I mean by that, if this is an ex-friend, it's like you've changed. And they really they, they really want to, like, <laughs> they want to know why. That's so weird. All of this chaotic energy around someone that's very calm. That's weird. Okay, let's go to our celebrity deck. Some of you could be holding on to, like, um, the past as well. Like, really tight. And it's like, you need to let that go. What's this tower moment? I have hope for us in the future as of right now. Nah. Okay, I'm gonna let my guard down. Yeah, vampire. Teaching me an uncomfortable lesson. Dark night of the soul is over. Haters spreading lies. I'm on your body. Yeah. There's somebody that's spreading lies about you that wants to be you, right? And you know what the crazy part about it is? It's like they <laughs> they feel like <laughs> this is so funny. They feel like they can like do something with this. Or they feel like they're gonna like get somewhere with spreading these lies. But it like it just backfires. What are these what are these lies that this person's spreading? Emotionally manipulative. Highly favored by peers. Small timer. You know what? Watch the um Virgo reading. Retiring. Worst time ever. Crackhead for sure. They like your money, not you. Okay, so for some of them, they feel like okay. They 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 don't even feel like this because they they <laughs> even in the cards is telling me that they big happen. Because why would somebody think all of these things about you like honestly and genuinely if they want to be you? It's like oh, so you want to be all of the things that you're spreading about me? You know what I'm saying? That type of energy. This person's goofy as hell. All right. So for one, 
they feel, they, they don't look, again, I don't know why, okay, they could feel this way, but it's out of their hatred towards you. So it's like they spread lies about you being emotionally manipulative, um, but people still fucks with you. What? Um, with this small timer and retiring, I'm getting the energy of like, somebody could be watching like your, what is this? Like your growth or your success in life. Like even more than what they're doing, like even more than like making sure that their stuff is straight. You know what I'm saying? I feel like this, <laughs> you know, you know that scene of like, you shouldn't talk because you don't got a pot to piss in. I'm getting that energy. Yeah, it's like, oh, this person's a small timer. This person's not going to go anywhere. But again, that's not the freaking facts. Yeah, or like you're, you're on drugs. You don't care about your, your, your fans or something, whatever. Love spout. This person's weird. Okay, I feel like, yeah. Yeah, I was getting that energy. I feel like this is a person that just does too much in general. I kind of feel like they're doing love work on like an ex as well they're doing love work on the ex that doesn't want them and they're gonna get like major karma for that like major karma for that so if you know like an ex friend or like an ex i don't know loser or something that like you know that this person is spreading lies about you or even if you don't like you know now they're gonna get so much karma for like <sighs> this love work that they're doing because I don't feel like it's like love work. It's, it's like hate love work. It's, it's like they want revenge on their on their partner or something. This person's a hot ass mess. Y'all. Alright, let's get into your person's messages. Because what the hell. Okay, let's get into Cancer's person's messages. Look, somebody might be hitting you up for money. Or this could have been, like, a friend that used to hit you up for money all the time. Or, like, a dude that used to hit you up for money all the time. Okay, let's see. Ooh. I just heard secretly. <laughs> I constantly think about our sexual moments secretly. We're dealing with the Pisces. Or, ooh, I just heard Taurus as well. Look, haters spreading lies again. Why won't this person get off your ass? I feel like they need to get off their ass. I feel like they don't do nothing. Ooh, Snapchat. Okay, your if you've ever sent, <laughs> if you sent, like, um, videos of you, like, doing freaky things to someone, I just heard in their bed, they're watching that. But I don't feel like you're talking to this person. Yeah, look, negative <laughs> negative gossip about you. Haters. Bye, haters. I need some money. Oh, you know what I'm getting? I feel like somebody, like, wants to talk about you to get money. So, like, you could have, like, um a public platform of some sort. Or you could, like, you know, have, like, an online business. Like, with cosmetics, um... Even, like, selling, like, herbs and stuff or candles is also what I'm seeing. Or, like, even press on nails is also what I'm hearing as well. It's, like, somebody wants, I feel like somebody wants clout. Or they just want to, like, prove something to other people. Yeah. I feel like this person is very jealous of you. Not attracted nor interested. This could be somebody that's not attractive. Or like, this could be a person that doesn't get... <sighs> like, I feel like, I feel like <sighs> they don't get interested parties in like love relationships and stuff. I'm talking to my ex again. Sleeping on you. Ooh, so many things remind me of you. What's this I'm talking to my ex again? Yeah, your and I knew that's what that was. I knew that's what that was. I did. <laughs> let me just that. I didn't want to say that that was what that was, but that's what that was. All right. There's literally an ex that's about to pop up, Cancer, because they feel like you are like escaping them. I also feel intimidation with this. So like you could be. I don't. 
okay, it might have to do with money. So you could have, like, made more money than this person, and they're panicking over, like, not only the fact that you make more than them, but the fact that, like, you're making more and more, and it's like they can't, they can't, like, they couldn't meet you at, at your level, like, when you were just making just enough, or, like, I don't know. It's like the more that you grow, the more that they're scared. Yeah, I'm eating my words and I hate it. Instagram. Dirty little secret. Gang stalking. Again, I feel like there is somebody that is like really just super invested in your life. What is this dirty little secret? I couldn't let you get close to me. Big bitter and I'm pissed the fuck off. <laughs> and I'm pissed the fuck off at you. Look, talking about your money. So the big secret is somebody is hurt. And it looks like it's a hater. Because of your money. It's like this person talks about your money. They talk about your life, your lifestyle, how you do things, what you do. This person has a freaking STD. What is this? Somebody has an STD. I miss you. You know what? No, I'm going to use my other deck. What is this? Who has an STD? Somebody is so bitter. Moving in silence. Oh, just let. So this is a secret. Hidden feelings. Oh, I feel like this is a hater. I don't know why you would need to know all of this information about a hater, but like. Is coming through. I feel like there's there's a hater that secretly has an STD because like they just have casual sex, but it doesn't feel like this person wants casual sex. So it's like the only thing they could get is casual sex, and they settle for that, and then like they cry about it later, but they got an STD because of this, and they're also like kind of hard up on money or something. Your what, what, what the fuck? What the fuck? Alright. Let's continue. I want to make this house a home. Ooh, some of you... Some of you are about to get engaged. Period. Alright? Or like you're about to merge families with someone. Yeah, look. You got a lot of freaking money coming in for you. But I feel like for some of you... One day you might want to fuck with this person. One day you don't. But they want to wife you. Yeah, I feel like this is why somebody's mad too. Like, because they can't get wife. And, like, you're getting wifed or you can get wifed. Or somebody, oh, somebody's mad because, like, they have to be kept as a secret and you don't. Wow. My emotion, yeah, somebody's emotions change with the moon and cancer. It might be you. Yeah. <laughs> I choose you. You know what? The same thing that I told Pisces, so you could be dealing with, like, this person could be a Pisces. Um... I feel like these bitches is going to jail. Yeah, look, jealous ex friends snooping, talking shit. I love when you throw that shit back. That gives me chills. And I'm secretly competing with you. Child, what? I feel like somebody watches your old stuff or like looks at your old pictures because they can't get in contact with you. Yeah, I'm broke as a joke, so I just avoid you and commitment. And again, hair spreading freaking lies why does this keep on coming up what does this person want obsessed with that booty i'm a motherfucker just sent that into you yeah i feel like somebody's up your ass but they 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 pretend like they're not yeah ptsd yeah this person's crazy <laughs> i feel like this person may have like some mental health issues because they want to be like committed to you or like they want to be a part of whatever you're doing which is weird but like they they go crazy or they have like anxiety whenever they see you or whenever they this is so weird yeah this is a okay this could be at work Jealous bitches hating on that connection. I feel like this this person is jealous of, like, the connections that you make in general. I feel like this person is jealous of, like, how your work life is going, how your, how your social life is going, how your love life is going. Yeah, like, they're, they're super, they're super mad. They're big mad. They're so freaking mad. It's just like, I can't stand this bitch. <laughs> yes, sir, what the hell? You're... 
I read Cancer. So that was your reading. Do not forget to like this video and comment down below. And I will see y'all later. Alright.